Well, in South Charlotte, there is a place called the CW Williams Community Health Center. If you haven't heard of it yet, you probably will, but it provides holistic care for the uninsured, underinsured, and anyone in between. Built on the vision of Dr. C.W. Williams more than 50 years ago, the facility is tackling the high cost of health care head on. I came here off the streets, to be honest with you. I came here off the streets of, of the streets of Charlotte. Like it was it was I was in a very, very dark place mentally, physically, and spiritually. After the dream of becoming a race car driver didn't pan out, Alan Ward says he was in search of a helping hand. They definitely have pulled me out of a dark place. It was the hope shot. It was my safe haven. Afraid of being judged and not knowing where to turn, Ward took a chance on the C.W. Williams Community Health Center, a place that looks at the entire person as an individual. I think we've worked hard to get where we are today. So we have wonderful providers. We provide not only medical services. At the helm is CEO Deborah Weeks, marching in the footsteps of Dr. C.W. Williams, who opened the center in 1981. It's one of more than 300 federal qualified health centers in the state to knock down the barriers to quality health care. That hard work he put into it, we're trying to honor today. We're making sure that his plan is not only just in place, but has fruit. The center is an affordable option offering medical and dental services along with a pharmacy that has low prices on prescriptions. The goal is to transfer the savings to patients and provide holistic care for anyone no matter what they need. We are culturally and linguistically capable of handling the diversity that comes through. Yeah. You know, we have a lot of diversity now. We're seeing at this site particularly, huh. we're starting to see even Russian patients and Ukrainian patients and really looking at black and brown populations and what prevents us from having healthy babies. And expansion is on the horizon. Soon the community center will have a one-stop shop open on Wilkinson Boulevard, aside from their secondary site on Old Pineville Road. Keep in mind that Dr. C.W. Williams started this fight almost 50 years ago. Weeks and her staff continue to keep the vision on track. Without it, people like Alan Ward wouldn't have found the help he needed get out of self mm -hmm. and trust that somebody like C.W. Williams can help you get better. At the moment, there are 317 other federally qualified health centers here in North Carolina, but Week says funds are dwindling. So volunteers and donations, they are always appreciated. WCNC has all, uh, partnered with uh, Pride Magazine to share stories just like this one. If you'd like to read more about the program, head to pridemagazineonline.com.